Mr. Tassel, you are under arrest for felony theft and obstruction of justice. You forgot making you look bad. You know, for a minute there, you actually made me believe that you were human. Cuff him. Ooh, bondage. My safe word is apples. Oh, there's no need to be gentle. Castle, if you're going in, you should be armed. My backup's in the glove compartment. I can't find it. It's... This time you're staying put. Oh, okay. <laughs> Back in. Very funny. Joke's over. Come on! Cuff me once, shame on you. Cuff me twice, shame on me. Hmm. You're gonna be a locksmith, you gotta listen. Left over right, right over left. I think I made it tighter. Joseph, do you see the building? Uh, that's a negative. Now bring it around. Back it. Oh, hey, Alexis. Uh, are you looking for your dad? To me. Okay, what's up? Yeah, yeah, we can meet at Sutton's around 7.30. Is that okay? All right, I'll see you then. Was that Alexis calling you? Why? She needed my advice. About what? I don't know. It's probably no big deal. When you kept secrets from your father, was it not a big deal? You know, I'm not even going to ask. Let me see your hand. Drop it. Get him up. Ah! Whoa. Castle? Becky? What are you doing here? I, uh... Down, down! Put it down! Drop that gun now! Drop, gun. Drop the gun, stupid! Yeah, no, no, it's okay. Drop it, slime bag! Whoa. Okay, guys, easy. It's not what it looks like. It never is. Turn around. Castle, turn around. Richard Castle, you're under arrest for murder. Clear. He's gone. I'm fine. Ryan needs an ambulance. No, I don't. Hey, what happened here? I'm so glad that you're okay. He's the triple killer. He set Gates up to be a copycat. I know. I did the math when you and Ryan didn't come back from talking to Jerry. Where's Beckett? Who are you? Where's Castle? He's not the only one here, you know. <laughs> I'm so... I'm so sorry, Martha. Oh. Excuse me. Hmm. Don't get up yet. Stay in bed. Castle. Kate. Hi. Castle. What? Did you do this? What? Stop saying what and wake up. I don't... We're handcuffs. Kinky. Castle, it's not funny. I didn't say funny. I said kinky, and I didn't cuff us. What do you, you think I cuffed us? Well, they look like police cuffs. Somebody else did this to us. You okay? Yeah, you? Who are you? Where the hell are you taking us? Wherever it is, it's way down. <gasps> See you soon. Okay, we got a minute, maybe two, to get the hell out of here. Castle, how tight are your zip ties? Can you move your hands at all? Mm, no, just barely. Do you have anything sharp in uh, your pocket, uh, like uh, a knife? No. Nail clippers? No. Who carries nail clippers? Do you have keys? No, it's a fob. It's a remote. There's, there's, there's a, a drywall screw. Perfect. That's, that's not going to help. Ah, I beg to differ. All I have to do is grab a zip tie and saw through. I am barely making a dent in this thing. Castle, I hear footsteps. He's coming. Hurry. Man, if we got murdered right now, I'd feel so ripped off. Yeah, me too. At least... 
we had last night. We should have done that four years ago. Done what four years ago? Oh, well, how about these words? You and your hooker friend are under arrest for interfering with my murder investigation. Turn around. Thanks for the drink. Cheers. I cannot believe I let you talk me into getting involved in another department's murder investigation. Oh, like I needed to twist your arm. And at least we know we were right about this guy. Does he look like he has a guilty conscience to you? He's sleeping like a little baby. You're like a baby chainsaw. Castle, Beckett, Chief Brady wants to see this. Richard Castle. You're under arrest for the murder of Tessa Horton. less fun than the other night at your place. Do you remember the first time you handcuffed me? We were at the New York Public Library. Remember how angry you were that I wouldn't stop investigating that case? Yeah, I remember. What I wouldn't give to be there now. Castle, this isn't over. I promise you I will get you out. It's okay. Whatever happens, it's okay. Listen, Leo, you don't want to do this. Okay, killing a cop's going to bring you a lot of grief from the NYPD, the FBI. Just let me go. Sorry, I can't do that. I did find your relationship fascinating, though. Boy, you and Castle have some real issues. It's a shame you won't be able to work them out. But, like I said, life's too short. That has got to be the strangest brush with death I've ever had. Me too. But I'll tell you, after that experience, if I ever have to be hitched to someone, it would be you. Hitched? Hitched. No, I didn't say hitched. I said cuffed. Handcuffed, not hitched. The colloquial or any other connotation or meaning. It's okay, Castle. I understood what you meant. And for what it's worth, if I ever have to spend another night handcuffed to someone again, I wouldn't mind if it was you, either. Really? The next time, let's do it without the tiger. Next time. If you give a little love, give a little love, little love.